And Jim Bright is with us today. He is one of the trustees on the board of the South Orange County Community College District. We always like having you here. Thank you very much. Yeah, it's good great. To be, good to be here. And of course, uh, we look at a couple campuses and really a third campus. We have Saddleback and we have Irvine Valley. And uh, then a we have ATEP. ATEP, which is really both uh, Irvine Valley and Saddleback kind of right. funnel into there. Right. Am I right? And yeah. we're, we're just start, we're going to build our, our first building, hopefully, starting possibly this fall. Oh, great. So. Good. Yeah, we're making some progress. That is fantastic. So we're going to talk about all kinds of things that are going on with um, the college district today. And uh, you always got good things to report on and entertainment and all kinds of things. Now, um, one, of the, uh, one of the things that I know has been going on there, um, I don't know if you're going to get to this or not, but your wonderful drama department. And right. it's just absolutely incredible. For, but first, the Emeritus Institute. Right. I Let think me, we're having on Dan tomorrow. We are having Dan on tomorrow. Well, good. Good. Yeah, we have a couple of courses there I just wanted to talk about for just a few minutes with the Emer Ooh, Emeritus nice. Institute. One was the uh, Dorothy Marie Lowry Distinguished Guest Lecture Series. Uh -huh. And that's, it's, it's in full swing right now at Saddleback at the Emeritus Institute. The class is a humanities class, modern world culture. Even though the class has already started, it's not too late to enroll. Coming up on March the 11th is Mr. Timothy Varish, who will present the Constitution of the United States, its history, and its content. Fantastic. Which I think is important right now. Yeah. Then on March 18th, Dr. Uh, or Mr. Charles Roseman will present his way, up, his way Up, an actor's perspective. There are many interesting lectures that will be pre pre presented. So if people want to enroll, all they need to do is contact Saddleback College Emeritus Institute for more information. All right, very good. And then at Irvine Valley College, there is a film course that I want to just talk about for a minute. English 435, film genres. And this is a film appreciation and discussion course. It's considered a drop-in class, so students can add at any point. Oh, that's nice. During the spring semester. <clears throat> And you'll explore the foreign and independent films with instructor Catherine Kramer, who won the American Film Institute Prize for her own work in writing and filmmaker. And it's actually at three different places. Rancho Senior Center on Mondays from 1 to 4, the okay. Laguna Beach Community Center on Tuesday from 12.30 to 3.30, and the Tustin Senior Center on Wednesdays from 1 to 4. Very just good. Just contact the Irvine Valley. Okay, so, very good. And the other thing I wanted to really brag about or talk about for a minute was uh, on February the 5th, Saddleback College hosted the second annual South Orange County Economic Report Luncheon. And uh, this was where more than 300 elected officials, business industry representatives, and community leaders were in attendance to hear details of the South Orange County Economic Report. And the principal author there was uh, Dean Anthony Tang. He's the Dean of Advanced Technology and Applied Science. I know him very well. Great. And what the report included was some demographics, some employment statistics, and key industry sectors in South Orange County. And the report, for instance, showed that the South Orange County economy grew in several areas. One was in gross regional products, employment, and also average earnings, which is always good to hear. Yeah, very good. Uh, and. Uh, uh, the Orange County uh, Supervisor Lisa Bartlett was a speaker. Lucy Dunn, President of the, and CEO of the Orange County Business Council was there. She talked. Paul Simmons, Chairman of the South Orange County Economic Coalition, talked also, as well as Saddleback College President Dr. Todd Burnett. Okay, very so. good. And then I It's nice to hear, by the way, the it's growing. The economy oh, is, it yeah, is. Fantastic. Although there are several things that uh, possibly could be improved upon, but it really is growing. Yeah, that's nice. And then I want to talk a little bit about the men's basketball team at Saddleback yeah. College. Doing extremely well. Their record right now is 28 and 1. Wow, fantastic. And, fantastic. and they're in the regional playoffs now. There's a game tonight. They play uh, Bakersfield College. It's at 7 p.m. and it's at Saddleback College. Very so, good. So a, that's a fantastic. Oh, they, they've done well. They were the state champions last year. Yeah. And, I remember, and, and so they're, and they're, if you pick folks, anybody can go to the game, you know. Anyone can go to the okay. game, that's right. So, 
That'll be fun, yeah. And I also wanted to say something about Irvine Valley College, too. Their men's basketball coach is going, to, his name is a Coach Ross mm -hmm. Duncan. He's been chosen to represent the U.S. in the International Tennis Federation Young Senior World Ch Team Championship in Umag, Croatia. Wow. This year marks the fifth straight year that he's been able to play for the team. He's one of the top 24 American players in that age category. For the second year in a row, he has been named the c captain of this year's squad. It's great to see the caliber of coaches that our colleges have. Yeah, that is uh, fantastic. That's really wonderful. I seem to find that in general, Jim, that uh, community colleges, whether it's whether it's Saddleback or Orange Coast or any of them, right. they have uh, when it when it comes to coaches, fantastic coaches. Right. Uh, as you as you may remember, the fantastic golf team. Yes. That uh, I forget the guy who had a. Uh, I remember Kearney, right? Kearney, Bill, yeah. Kearney, Bill Kearney. Bill, yeah, I took him. I took a couple courses oh, from him. Yes. Yeah. And, bo and both colleges have done extremely well in athletics. Yeah. Yeah. We also had a President's Cup uh, basketball game where Irvine Valley College and Saddleback play, and uh, they sort of have a cup back and forth who, who wins. Oh, that's so, fun. Yeah, it is fun. So. Yeah, definitely. And I, then I wanted to also mention that coming up at both schools are their annual uh, foundation okay. galas. Yes. Uh, at Saddleback College on March the... Uh, March 12th, it looks March like. March the 12th, it looks like, which is coming up in a week from Saturday. Yes, it is. Uh, and the college foundations play an important role in helping many of our students mm -hmm. succeed. They provide a lot of scholarships. Uh, without the foundation's effort, many of our students would not be able to continue in college. So the foundation supports our college programs. The Saddleback Foundation Gala, again, is Saturday, March the 12th at 6 p.m. at the Laguna Cliffs Marriott Resort and Spa. Beautiful facility. Right, beautiful, oh, yeah. beautiful yeah. facility. And Irvine Valley College is going to be having their gala on Saturday, April the 2nd. And this will begin at 5 p.m. And it's going to be held at the Marconi Automobile Museum, which I think will be a nice place. Yeah, that's going to be really CBS. nice. It'll be exciting even to celebrate all that happens that makes IVC extraordinary, surrounded by a collection of classic and exotic cars. That'll be a lot of fun. That's, uh, Is that up in Tustin, that yes, facility, I think? Yes, yeah. yes, mm -hmm. yes. Uh, April the 2nd. All right. And then finally, I just wanted to brag about a couple of other mm -hmm. events that are coming up at Saddleback College. There is a, 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 a the big band swing thing. It's Friday, March the 18th, 7.30 p.m., McKinney Theater. Uh, swing music will be performed to raise funds for the jazz programs at Saddleback College. They always do. I know this has gone on over the years. Oh, it's yes. always popular. It's very, very popular. Yeah. And then finally, uh, at Irvine Valley College, on Friday, March the 11th, coming up in, in about a week, is the uh, Chamber Music Connect concert. A variety of music will be performed by musicians from the community of Irvine. It's a great opportunity to see local talent and the concert is free. All right, very so, good. Very good. So, yeah, that's, uh, again, as I mentioned, you folks have uh, just great, great performances that you do. Well, thank you. It's, in Th it's thank incredible. You. That'll be fun, uh, both those galas, March yes. 12th, and then uh, up at IVC at the uh, Car Museum. Yeah, That'll be a lot of fun, definitely. April 2nd, sure. Good to see you. Thank you. We thank appreciate your update. And I uh, always like to have you folks come by. Good. All right, we'll see you next time, and we'll be right back. Always good to see you.